you can generate any kind of video to animation using Stable Diffusion. Watch my whole video and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. To animate any video you need to have Stable Diffusion installed. You can watch my video how to install Stable Diffusion unlocked version with one click. Video link is in my description. You also need ControlNet installed. Usually when you install Stable Diffusion ControlNet is already installed. If you don't got it installed you can go to Extensions tab on your Stable Diffusion. Click on Available option and click on Load From. Type ControlNet you will find it in List click on Install and Restart your Stable Diffusion. Next thing you need is Universe Diffusion Model. You can click on link in my description to download it. After downloading it put it in Stable Diffusion Main Model folder and use it as Main Model. Click on Image to Image tab. Upload a picture as test to do settings. Change sampling steps to 6. Change resolution similar to your picture resolution for better result. Change batch count to 1. Change CFG scale to 1.5 and denoising strength scale to 1. Type any random seeds rather than minus 1 or result will vary. After done with image to image settings click on control net extensions. This extension got three options. Choose first option and enable it. If you got 4 GB or lower RAM choose lower RAM and choose pixel perfect option. Choose tile slash blur control net type. You also need control net models you can click on links in my description and download all control net models you need. After downloading all ControlNet model paste them in main stable diffusion folder then extensions folder. ControlNet then inside model folder. Also choose control net is more important from options at the bottom. After done with first click on second control net option. Choose same settings you did for first. Choose all in control net style and choose diff model in models option. Also choose control net is more important in option at the bottom.
After done with second choose third control net option. Choose same settings you did for first two. Choose soft edge control net style. And model. Also choose control net is more important at the bottom. After done with all the settings you need to type positive and negative prompt. If you are not good with prompt you can go to Universe model page. From there copy and paste both negative and positive prompt. You can do changes to prompt if you want. After done with prompt you need LoRa model. Click on link in my description to download LoRa LCM model. After downloading it go to main stable diffusion page. Inside models folder. Paste it inside LoRa folder. To load it just click on I. It will appear in prompt. Now click on generate to generate picture to see result. Face look awkward to fix this you need a detailer extension. You can download it from available extensions in Stable Diffusion. Click on it and enable it. You don't need to type any prompt or do any changes. Generate picture again. If you are happy with result you can move on to next step or do more changes to make it better. Click on batch option. Copy and paste path of sequence images you extracted from video. You can watch my video how to make sequence images from any video. Copy this folder path and paste an input folder option. Also make two folders there and copy and paste their paths in options.
After done choose click generate. This will generate all images one by one and save an output folder you choose. Now you have to combine all these images and convert them into video. Watch my next video how you can combine pictures to video. Thank you for watching my video if you got any question comment. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Take care.